The projections by international demographers, particularly in the UN, is that we will become a city-state of 25 million people by the year 2015. What we're simply trying to do here is that first we become a mega city by status because of our population and we set ourselves the objective to become the model mega city for Africa, a city where people can live, work and play. The Eco Atlantic City is so many things in one. Yes, it's a huge civil works project, but it also enables government to respond to the challenges of nature, erosion in the southwest and south-south coastal shoreline of Nigeria. It also provides the opportunity to forge the critical synergy between the public sector and private sector. The whole project from the restoration, the reclamation, up to the reconstruction will create jobs, create opportunities for so many other sectors of the economy. Therefore, government has used its policies on environment to fuel the private sector, which certainly is the engine of growth. So it's, it's a very strategic partnership. I am part of an administration that ran for eight years, that planned this project. So I was persuaded not only by its merits, but also its benefits. And, and seamlessly, I have taken it on as my own baby to deliver it. In terms of the public perception, I am inundated almost on a weekly basis, people wanting to prepare. And if there is any barometer at all about how people feel about it, about how expectant they are about it, it is this huge demand that we want to live there.